All right, so here we go. We're another boot brand review. And uh, this time, uh, I promised a, a review of Blackjack boots. They're uh, kind of an offshoot of Lucchese. Uh, one of the boot makers there at Lucchese went off and formed Blackjack. And then another iconic brand that I have uh, a couple, uh, three, three pairs of, uh, Rio of Mercedes, which is a, another great uh, Texas boot brand. So uh, before we get started, let's check out the watch. Uh, today it's a Seiko Mod. So this is a, uh, a Seiko that <clears throat> is made to look like the, uh, the Pepsi. Pepsi bottle cap, and so they took an automatic Seiko mod, modified the dial, and then uh, um, made it made, spruced it up a little bit. Say hi to Jenny, hi to Daisy. Uh, so boot check, you know, we'll go through the the boots we have, but these are the classic uh, Lucchese uh, alligator belly that I'm wearing now. And I just got them out again out of the closet. Uh, beautiful boots and. Uh, we're also going to do a review. I'm surprised I have not reviewed this uh, Davidoff before. It's actually one of my favorite Davidoffs to go to. Uh, pricey, but if I want to have a great, great smoke, a strong smoke, I will go with the uh, Millennium from Davidoff. Uh, the Robusto is really good. Um, I was going to do this Colorado Claro here, but uh, I realized that I already did a review. So, so I've got this... Uh, <clears throat> Three pack with uh, at least one remaining in here. Oh, it's a four pack with three remaining. Yeah, bonus. And uh, so here's the uh, Millennium. A uh, great, great cigar. And so we'll get into that in a few minutes. But uh, let's let's hit the uh, boots here and see what we got. So we got some special ones here. So a couple of boxes. Uh, box is always great to keep. So there's the Rios box. There's the Blackjack. And we have some that are hidden, and we'll un, uh, we'll take take those off. Actually, these uh, boot socks here are Lucchese boot socks on the one uh, pair of blackjacks. But uh, so we got several blackjacks there. There's three of them there. I got three pairs of Rios of Mercedes also. So let's start out with one of the Rios. Uh, Rios is uh, just again an iconic brand uh, out of Mercedes, Texas. These boots are green olive, and they are Nile crocodile belly. Um, just a fantastic boot. Look at the uh, cool uh, stitching on top, how they did that. Uh, Rios, it makes just really a phenomenal boot. I like that kind of the gray, light brown shaft. It's really thick, well done. Um, and again, I, you know, something about alligator or crocodile. Look at the scales. Just phenomenal boot. Phenomenal boot. So we'll switch that and compare that maybe to, how about these? These are blackjack. And this is a hornback um, alligator. So you can see the raised scales. I don't have too many of those. Um, I like them. Uh, really nice. You can see fancy shaft there on those. These are, again, blackjack. You can see blackjack label in there, sort of. Uh, going back, I don't know, the Rios. Rios doesn't do much other than they just kind of put a small little tag on there. But, uh, but anyway, so these blackjack are um, a cognac uh, color. And I do like this. They're really sturdy. So you get a lot of detail out of uh, the uh, alligator horns there. Um, nice inlays. So really a beautiful boot. Uh, sticking with blackjack, so you can kind of see the difference between a belly alligator and sort of the, the tail, right? Uh, the hornback tail. So, all smooth. These are black cherry. Um, Blackjack sometimes has this uh, Star of Texas inlay, which is pretty cool with the alligator in there. Um, let's see again. Let's see, let's see the Blackjack label there. 
Uh, really nice matching on the shaft there. Uh, the uh, cowhide leather that is perfectly stained to match. The only thing up with black cherry boots, they, they all tend to kind of, uh, you know, have this sort of blotchiness to them there, which, which I don't necessarily like, but almost every black cherry boot I've had has had that. So that is, again, the uh, beautiful blackjack. Uh, and that's alligator belly, so very smooth. It's American alligator. It's not a caiman. Caiman would have a lot of that sort of um, uh, kind of swirling inside the scale. Uh, generally, American alligator doesn't have that. And again, you can see the scaling here on, on the, uh, the other blackjack. So... So let's take a look at what's in, well, no, you know what? Let's go over here and uh, take a look. Actually, I left the other one out. I had forgot, I had forgot about these. These, again, you can see they're Rios there. And these are just uh, your, your calf skin. Uh, nice um, design, kind of that, that X coming up in the shaft. But these are cowhide. They're a little worn and beat up. Those are the ones I work out outside with. So they're great boots. Uh, Rios really last. Phenomenal looking boots. And then another pair that's in these uh, boot bags. Let's take a look and see what's in here. So inside these boot bags that I typically keep the now crocodile in is a pair of, again, your regular, uh, just a, like baby calf skin, uh, just a black boot, but can, you can really see the uh, quality and the craftsmanship of the Rios and Mercedes. Let me pull the other one out here and we'll look at both of them, but um, Rios is just a great brand. They just make a fantastic boot. So these, I just couldn't pass them up. They were uh, good, you know, baby calf, which is really nice and shiny. You can see the beautiful shine on that. I like the pointy toe um, design, kind of the X coming up there. And, uh, you know, very, just a classic black uh, boot. So a phenomenal looking boot. And then the last one, where Jenny is looking at. This one's really interesting. I think you're really going to like this one. Um, it is. I, I keep these in boot socks because of the delicate skin. So look at this. This is python. And it's just a phenomenal looking color. Um, beautiful skin. Uh, look at the detail of the shaft with the python there. Um, a phenomenal boot that, again, python is a little bit of, of a skin that, you know, I mean, it's sturdy, but you want to take care of it. So I keep it in the boot socks because I don't want uh, a lot of dust and, and so forth to get in there. Um, we'll take a look at the scaling there of that it's just a phenomenal looking boot um even just the entirety of the boot is really uh, a work of art there and again that's a blackjack so blackjack is a fine fine boot maker as are uh, rios of mercedes two phenomenal boot makers um can you go wrong with them i don't think so a little less expensive than uh, lucasi's um, and I, hard to tell that there's a, a drop off in quality. I think they're, they're just a phenomenal. So let's take a look at them in the sunlight in a moment, but, uh, let's get to that cigar. So if you, uh, if you're hanging with me here, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get that cigar reviewed. Um, and again, that is just this phenomenal, um, uh, millennium by Davidoff and so you can kind of see the difference in the wrapper um, coloring there that is the Colorado Claro so it's a little more reddish brown that Claro 
Uh, great cigar too. Hard to say which, they, they do have some different flavors, uh, profiles to them. Um, but I, I think this Millennium is, is certainly a top five, top ten cigar of mine. I, I you know, it, it, it could even rank in the number one uh, spot, depending on my mood. So we'll fire this uh, Millennium up here and uh, kind of let you know what we think about it. The uh, Davidoff line, you may have heard me say this before, but the, uh, the classic line of Davidoff, I think, is just a little bit too mild for me. So I really like this uh, Millennium Series, uh, the darker wrapper. I like the uh, Colorado Claro line. It's another phenomenal cigar. But this Millennium, I, to me, that is Davidoff. Now, um, you know, some may veer towards the old classic line, but uh, I, I just think this... Dark wrapper is the way to go. So, really kind of want to cherish this. It's a special cigar, not cheap, upwards of thirty bucks a stick, uh, but a great, great cigar. Now, the draw is perfect, although I didn't get a ton of smoke, I would say. Um, no resistance. They're getting a little warm. But you get a lot of an intense flavor there. I don't get any spiciness, which is good for me. I'm not a big fan, but intense flavor profile. So definitely sort of that chocolate, the char and roux. Um, you know, you get a little bit of hints of vanilla creaminess. It's, it's just a great, great cigar. Millennium. Now, a funny story. Of course, Davidoff is, uh, was originally a Cuban brand. So a lot of history there, although it doesn't go back as far as many of the Cuban lines. Basically came out around the time of Castro, um, but I was in Cuba and we visited the tobacco farm of um, of uh, Montesino, and uh, uh, a great tobacco farm. They show you where it's grown, and then uh, Senor Montesino will share a cigar with you. And I did that before and I went back again to some other friends who'd never been there. And I thought, you know, I'm gonna bring Senor Montesino a demo and see what he thinks of it. So I brought him a millennia. I brought him one of these. And it was funny. He, he was appreciative, but, you know, they have to watch what they say in Cuba, right? And, and so he, he was not overly enthusiastic about smoking it. He tried it. He lit it. Um, he said it was a little bit plain. <laughs> and and uh, um, you know, honestly,
most of the Millennium series, you know, have, have a pretty intense flavor profile. This one is starting out a little bit slow, so as I'm envisioning him telling me it's plain, it, it does taste a little plain all of a sudden. But, uh, yeah, normally I mean, it is, it goes, it'll really pick up in flavor. But a great, great cigar, Millennium. So, all right, well, let's, uh, if you come with me this long, let's take a look and see how those boots look in the sunlight. We'll take a scar. So here they are outside. And uh, wow, you can really see the detail. Of course, the sun's going behind the clouds now. But there's that python, blackjack. You can see the dark cherry, blackjack, the cognac of the hornback alligator. Just a beautiful classic from Rios. The very unique sage green Nile crocodile belly. And then the work boots from Rios. Uh, just a, a nice uh, maroon black cherry. So, uh, really nice uh, line of boots. Rios and Mercedes, blackjack. Can't go wrong. Great boot manufacturer. Go Browns, by the way. We're playing the Steelers tonight. So. Big game. Excited. Always excited for the Browns until they screw it up. So hopefully that won't happen this year, but chances are Browns will be Browns. Alright, well, we will see you again.